Hi guys, good morning and welcome back to my channel or if you're new, hi, welcome. My name is Megan and today's video I'm gonna just be doing a little vlog of my day, but I am in a new location I'm at my house down at school. I won't be here full-time I'm gonna be living part-time here with my friends and then part-time at home with my mom still So you'll see me kind of in different places in different videos and that's why I just woke up though And I got my Instagram post up. There's an honor launch today So I need to get the content ready to promote that and I am gonna go downstairs and I'm just gonna get some breakfast. I have like these egg bites that I'm gonna eat along with making a watermelon smoothie. Don't wanna be scared of love. I was just on the phone with my mom while I did all of my morning things, which was nice. I was just thinking about this as I was filming this vlog. There is no way that people really just wake up and get dressed for their day. That cannot really be a thing because I wear this. Like I will wear my big sleep shirt pajamas until it's time for me to leave the house. And if I don't leave the house, I'm not taking off my pajamas. But like there are people in vlogs who are always dressed and looking so slay in their house. And I'm like, go off queens because you really must have your shit together. But like, like, I don't change until it's time for me to leave or like it's time for me to get out of here Is this a me problem? Like do I need to grow up and get dressed? But like why get dressed to do nothing? Like why get dressed to still be in your house? Also, this watermelon slushy situation is so freaking good I just put some fresh watermelon lots of ice and then in this I put this juice that I get from Wegmans It's like a mixture of juices, but you could put like any type of juice I've had it with like coconut milk as well and it's good pineapple juice is good But anyways, I am gonna get dressed now, but as I was planning to get dressed I just thought of that and I was like do they think I'm weird for not getting dressed in my vlog or is this normal and comforting anyways I need to get dressed the gym OOTD. I have black sports bra and my sunset shorts. Obsessed, obsessed. And then I have my Nike 270s and some socks. I feel like I need to get some black socks because this looks kind of funky, but it'll do for today. It's actually kind of earlier than I wanted to go to the gym. Like it's still 11, but I'm already ready. So I'm just going to go early. Probably it's not busy, but I actually don't even think I'm going to record today. I was just anxious yesterday and <laughs> recording was just overstimulating, especially in like the upper body section. It looked super packed. So I'll just see, but I'm definitely Definitely gonna go get my workout in early and then I need to get gas. I have a lot of computer work that I have to do today so I don't really know when I'm gonna get that done but I definitely want to try to get my workout out of the way so that I don't have anything else that I'm waiting on. Yeah I'm gonna head to the gym now. Hi, I'm picking up two mobile orders. One is for Katie, and the other one is for Bungato, B-U-N-G-A-T-O. She asked what you were doing. That's so rude, like I'm doing so bad. there already, we'll see at the window. Thank you. How do you think that made her feel? Okay, but I feel like people say that as a formality, and one time I went to Taco Bell and they asked me that, he was like, hi, how are you doing? And I was like, hi, can I get a cheesy cordita crunch and three bean burritos and four soft tacos for you? We can talk about our days. My day, honestly. The days new, are not slaying. This new gym situation is not going well for me personally. It's a little bit too freaking busy yeah. and overstimulating. That's how I'm doing. How are you doing? I had an 8 a.m. So I had to like literally wake up at 6.30. It was dark. It was like so <laughs> awful and dark. And then my classes were so hard. I had three classes in a row and I got home and dropped. I was like, <laughs> drop. Like this class I went to, I had to literally speak. <laughs> I literally had to speak in my class. No, like, it was so no. sickening. You should never have to do that. Finally, that person in front of us, like, like took 10 happened? years. Ooh. Uh, are the straws. Thank, Thank you. You. you too. Katie got a frappuccino. Uh, my camera's gonna go fucking flying in a second. I'm gonna be gentle. Um, <laughs> I did get a frappuccino. <laughs> Baby, go, what is it? 
I can't be judged. I can't be judged. <laughs> 365, the movie was so fucking cringe, but we're still going we back to We had to close our blinds because we were so embarrassed that our neighbors would literally like see us watching that. And that we was were just so like, inappropriate. It was like so crazy. I was like, oh my goodness. But anyways, tell them what you got before I end this. I got, I think it's called like the espresso frappuccino or something. Yeah, it it's is. It's so good. It literally just tastes like caramel. And then... I got a birthday cake pop. So I got a, you know, caramel ribbon crunch vibe. I can't wait till salted caramel goes on the menu. Is that gonna happen? It better. Cause not, it didn't I happen last year. I have lived a year in distress yeah, and pain. What's up with that? We're gonna go to Earth Fair, which is so some fun. like new retro crazy. I don't think it's retro. I'm just lying. <laughs> It's like Whole Foods, that's what Amanda told us. It's giving like Whole Foods. It's like probably the nicest grocery store option that there is in this mm -hmm. area. Yeah, because we don't so, have no Trader Joe's, no Wegman, no No, Whole Foods. nothing. I honestly just need to get corn <laughs> for my castle. I'm going to look around and see what I find. <laughs> Okay, Earth Fair, freaking slay. So slay. Big slay. Literally 10 out of 10. We would look at it from Starbucks and we'd be like, we should go there. Yeah, like this is so Earth nice. Fair and then the Starbucks that we would always study at is over there. So convenient, but I got this chicken breast. Literally $4 for a bourbon six ounce chicken breast. Is it already seasoned? Yeah, like it's in bourbon sauce. Oh, good. So I was like, okay, bet. They had the puffs. They had the freaking Kroger, or where were we? They didn't have sweet potato puffs. Aldi, Kroger, or Kroger or Aldi. they're all out, but that of course, so Earth Fair came through. And I love these with barbecue chicken vibe. And then I got super sweet white corn, which is the only thing I needed going there because I'm gonna make a casserole. Katie left with some great yeah, I big need, fun. I needed nothing, but I <laughs> saw that they had this couscous. This is my favorite kind of couscous ever with the carrots in it. She literally was like, oh, um, chicken! I'm, they don't sell this couscous anywhere anymore. I thought they like discontinued it and then I saw it and I had to get it. Then I got roasted red pepper hummus because I need hummus, but I've never had roasted red pepper, so hopefully I like it. You will. And then I got this most slay snack ever, the Caesar pea crisps. This shit, it's so good. Like I want to open it so you can and try it but I have I one opened at home. It. Oh okay then I'll try it at home. But it, they're so good. Baked green peas, light and creamy peas. <laughs> Just try it. Try it. They look work. like penne noodles. They're so good. Uh -huh. It's so good. What? It's literally a vegetable. It's like healthy. They probably like baked the nutrients out of it but <laughs> It's good. It's so good. There's so much protein. Five it. grams of protein in 22 pieces. I could get so crazy. Shit, it's good. I'm gonna get these next time. Bungy and bussy. <laughs> But I'm gonna unbox. I just got an Amazon package. I'm waiting so patiently for my honor active package that <sighs> says it's out for delivery, but it's probably gonna come at like five. Excuse me. I got some LED lights, some more LED lights to finish off my room. If you guys haven't watched the moving vlogs, you guys should really do that, right, Katie? Is there a second one out? Because I'm It's coming and you're in one. it. Like, these are my strip lights. Gonna put them under my bed. Oh, those colors. Yeah, I didn't make that mistake again. Also, I finished Never Have I Ever yesterday. You finished it? Yeah, so fast. If you guys have seen it, let me know your thoughts and let me know your favorite man for Davey. casserole in the oven. I have a recipe for this already on my Instagram. It's kind of an old reel, but I'll pop it on the screen now and I'll have it in the description. It's just so easy to make because you can just buy a rotisserie chicken, chop it up, and then frozen veggies and it can be like a whole meal super fast. And I like to do this, make excess, and then eat it for lunches. It reheats well and I just eat it on top of rice. Usually I put croutons on top, but I don't have them. So just so you know, in case you guys want to make it, but my honor package came in five hours too late, but that's okay. It's not too late, hopefully, for you guys to get some of these pieces. Obviously, some of the classic Seamless probably has sold out, but I just wanted to do the unboxing with you guys. Let's get into opening the pack. Right. Lots of stuff in here. Honestly, I don't really remember what I was sent, so this will be fun. I see a lot of evergreen though, which is honestly becoming one of my favorite colors. So I'm gonna show you guys that first. So let's just open one, see what it is. Classic 2.0 evergreen shorts. I wear size medium in these. 
These are the ones that everyone loves because they're the shorter length. I feel like they should just make a ton of stock in these because everyone literally loves these. But I really like these in Effortless. I think I'll like them in Classic too. Classic is just definitely a tighter collection. So I don't love the fit on me as much as I think other people do. It really just depends on you and your body type. I'm super excited to have a Classic bra in Evergreen. I love this bra. It's my favorite. Probably going to cut the back strap off. I actually am a really big fan of these lounge bralettes. I know that these might not be everyone's cup of tea because the material, it doesn't have a ton of stretch at the bottom but they're super comfy this is it in evergreen and i'm excited to have the matching set in this because i wear these all the time i love these shorts these shorts are like my favorite i don't know what size i got they sent me a medium but apparently they made changes on these shorts so that they would fit more true to size meaning like you didn't have to size up so the medium might actually fit me how i want the small to fit me if they did make that change like i can tell that the waist is a lot more tapered and i think this is the normal classic bra yeah so here's the normal classic seamless bralette i I like these they're not my favorite because of the strappies it's kind of like a lot sometimes but i still think it's really cute so much evergreen i'm loving this here is the big t-shirt i get a size small because it does have an oversized fit i feel like i could also get like a medium though just for the length but this is super cute i like how it says it's small in the front and bigger in the back i kind of wear these more just around the house than i do like at the gym i'm assuming these are the evergreen leggings which i'm really excited about these because again i like that they're a thicker material for leggings because i feel like sometimes effortless can be super thin and i get the short length as well and i'm five foot three but i like that it kind of has like a little marling honestly this is the worst lighting to try to show you guys i'm seeing some deep taupe which i know is such a big hit in effortless so i hope they bring it in classic i'm sure they will here's just the deep taupe t-shirt i actually think i'll wear this a lot i really like this color this is rosewood in the jersey tank i actually like these tanks i don't know why i don't wear them more i kind of honestly just forget about them but this would be cute to like wear into the gym and then you can take it off when you get hot yeah, they sent me the tank in taupe as well which i really like this is like one of my favorite colors especially for fall i'll definitely start to wear this more i like that the color palette of this launch is definitely giving fall so they're kind of transitioning back into fall colors and then lastly i've wanted like a lounge set at midnight for a long time i'm so happy that i could get it in the shorts so here is like the racer back bra i love these and i i really like these like i'm probably gonna wear these new sets super soon and then obviously the shorts, which I absolutely love as well. I'm going to take some stuff for my Instagram, like little stories and stuff to show my Instagram. And then maybe I'll also do a try on. So if I try it on for Instagram, I will try it on for you guys as well. Hey.